we were curious about some stories that came out in the news after people were vaccinated against COVID. One was why Mayor Cantrell had a positive test after her vaccine. And another is why do some people still get a mild case after being fully vaccinated? Meg Ferris has tonight's Vax Facts. Last week, Mayor LaToya Cantrell was denied access to the White House after getting a positive result from a coronavirus test. Upon taking that, um, they gave me a call and said that I had tested positive. And I'm like, oh, no, I've never tested positive. Shortly afterwards, she had two more tests that were negative. She had just gotten her first dose of the COVID vaccine two days earlier. Did that make a difference? Getting the vaccine will not give you a false positive test. Tulane microbiology and immunology expert Dr. Bob Gary says the PCR tests the mayor had are more than 98 percent accurate. He suspects it was a false positive. This apparently is what happened uh, to the mayor. She, you know, just happened to be in that unlucky one percent where the test gave a false result. Now, why are we seeing headlines like this? where some people test positive and have mild symptoms after full vaccine immunity? We know the vaccine does not give you the virus, and the current ones are 95% effective. That is um, not 100%. So, you know, five people out of 100 are, are going to get infected, and they're, they're, the vaccines are going to keep you from getting a severe illness. So the vaccines will not necessarily keep you from getting infected when you're exposed to the virus. You might just replicate the virus enough to make the test come up positive, but you're either going to be asymptomatic or have very mild illness. You breathe virus in, it starts to multiply, then your immune system fires up and shuts it down, keeping virus load low so you don't get really sick. But this is why a mask is still needed after your vaccine so you don't spread it to others who are not vaccinated. Hopefully when all of us get the vaccine and we drive this virus into the ground, you know, then there won't be a need for the mask and social distancing anymore. And with supplies ramping up, that could come sooner than later. For Vax Facts, I'm Meg Farris. The PCR COVID test that the mayor had is not the rapid test. The rapid was not quite as accurate as the PCR test.